What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Chill Flame, and I'm back at again at the video. If y'all new to the channel, make sure you guys slap that like and subscribe button. If y'all don't slap that like, if y'all don't slap that like button, I'ma slap the shit out, y'all. For real, I'm not in the mood, bro. Today is December. I think today is December 29th, right? Is it? Is the 29th? Uh, okay, whatever day it is, whatever day it is, y'all like that, okay? I like it. I love it. But like I was saying, y'all. Let's just get to it, man. So I was scrolling on Twitter, right? And it was like, what was the worst matches in WWE this year? In which it was like Shayna Blaze, which y'all know. I, I talked about that match. That match was ass cheeks. That match was garbage. Good Lord, that match was trash. Then we had Solo. Then we had Solo versus John. Then we had Jay Uso versus Roman. I ain't gonna lie. That match wasn't bad. It just it didn't follow, like it literally didn't follow the rules of com like tribal combat, tribal combat. Like nobody was supposed to get, like it was supposed to be no interference or nothing, and there was still interference in the match, so it didn't make sense at all. But we're not talking about that, y'all. We talking about John Cena versus Solo Sikoa. So if y'all. Of course, we seen it, bro. This match in Happy Path. Crown Jewel. Now, how I watched this match. I watched this match. I'm be honest with y'all. If y'all didn't know, I work well, if you work at Walmart, you know what I'm talking about. I was stalking. Watching this match. And my phone was in my pocket. And for some odd reason, I took it out of my pocket and I started watching the match. And I'm like, hmm, okay, it's a little interesting, you know what I'm saying? They, they going at it. And then for some odd reason, John Cena powered up. He, he about to do his little Super Cena. You, like, he used to do that. And then for some odd reason, um, yeah. Yeah, um, um, he, he just, like, the ending threw me off so bad, like, Bro, real life hit John Cena with three Samoan spikes. Like I think three or four Samoan spikes. And when as I'm watching this and I'm looking at him hitting these Samoan spikes on John Cena, in my head, in the back of my head, I'm like, bro, this shit is not gonna do nothing. This shit is not intimidating. John can't like John is not finna like kick out of this, right? And then he covered John Cena. And that made me realize what the was this okay cool we all knew okay maybe the writer i think around this time the writer strike was it. the writer strike ended right but let's be honest john the past couple years bro john literally has been putting over a lot of people he's been putting over the people but the way he like put solo over was like what the fuck is this like he could have just got a like a a better win like this how it was weird how it ended and you could tell it was weird by the fans like it was i ain't gonna lie after this like after the match indy solo sitting in the ring and it's just quiet like when i'm watching this i'm like i'm like what the fuck like this was supposed to be his coming out party beating john like this, no this ended ain't it this ended garbage who did who thought of this Like, why? Who did he, like, what, what wrong with y'all? I need God in your life. This wasn't it. Now, like I said, y'all, this match was trash to me. It was me. But I want to talk about something else. This really didn't help so. Okay, yeah, maybe, hey. I forgot. I forgot the last match. I think this is the last match Solo had. No, I think he had. No, he had a match with Solo. He had a match with LA Knight. I'm tweaking. I'm tweaking bad. He had a match with LA Knight. Oh my tripping. This how. This how I don't really care about Solo as a girl. I'll be forgetting the matches that he had. This really don't. Then it did something for John, but it's like, bro, he really beat Great Value John Cena. Like he didn't beat Prime John Cena. 
like bro real life set up in Uh, damn, I'm trying to think, bro. All right. Nah, Brian, Brian, Brian literally still in this prime, so I can't. Hmm. Oh, example. Give y'all example, y'all. John Cena was Peyton Manning. John Cena was Peyton Manning. Bro, I want to compare. No, I can't. I can't compare Solo to the Broncos. Because the Broncos. The, damn, bro. I mean, I can't compare. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it, y'all. Y'all let me know a comparison, y'all. Like, bro, he really beat great. I'm going to say it. He beat John Cena if he was great value. So it's like Solo really didn't gain nothing from beating John Cena. Like, he, he didn't beat Prime almost out my Prime John Cena. He, like, he beat John Cena to us, like, hey, dog, I'm putting you over. It is what it is. But I feel like Solo ain't really been doing nothing since this, bro. Like, he just been, hey, I'm not going to talk. Hey, if I, you're my brother. If you know it was a setup, you would tell me. I got you. That's, like, that's all, this, that's all he really been doing. But yeah, y'all, I ain't gonna lie. Y'all let me know in the comment section, bro. Was this match really ass? Oh, my tripping. I don't feel like it was ass. It was ass. But hey, I'm Trey Flame. Hey, make sure you hit that like and subscribe, bro. I'm trying to get to 2,000 subs. I'm out. I love y'all. Peace.